Hello everyone. <coughs> so uh, let us discuss one topic which is called as E of fine grain soil is greater than E of coarse grain soil. Now, if I try to draw a fine grain soil and a coarse grain soil, fine grain soil will look like this. There will be much closer baking than which is shown here. So this is a fine grain soil, okay, fine grain soil, <clears throat> then this is a coarse grain, so it will look like this so in fine grain soil uh, the, the number of foids is more ok number of foids if we consider it as nf number of foids of fine grain soil and if I consider the number of foids in coarse grain soil so number of foids in fine grain soil is greater than number of foids in coarse grain soil then um, volume of foids if I consider the volume of foids in fine grain soil as phi phi of fine grain soil and if I consider the volume of weights in coarse grain soil, so what we can see here is volume of weights of fine grain soil is greater than volume of weights for coarse grain soil. Then, if I consider the volume of solids, volume of solids in fine grain soil as PSF and volume of solids in coarse grain soil so volume of solids in fine grain soil is less than volume of solids in coarse grain soil so now if i try to write the void ratio so e of fine grain soil is let us say F say it as EF and E of coarse grain soil let us take it as EC EF and EC so it is what volume of voids of fine grain by volume of solids of fine grain and volume of voids of coarse grain by volume of solids of coarse grain now we can see here volume of voids of fine grain is greater than volume of voids of coarse grain and volume of solids for fine grain is lesser than volume of solids of coarse grain so ultimately this term EF it becomes ultimately greater than EC so that's why uh, we can say that E of fine grain soil is greater than E of coarse grain soil. Thank you very much.